Peru is one of my favorite countries in South America. The diversity is simply amazing. High in the Andes in La Cordillera Blanca, 20,000 foot peaks tower above glacial lakes. Taking a short one hour and 40 minute flight east across the country, you will find yourself in the biggest rainforest on earth, the Amazon. However, the most famous place in Peru is undoubtedly Machu Picchu. The 15th century Inca citadel set up at 8,000 feet in elevation, a few hours from the city of Cusco. My good friend Kurt and I had the chance to visit Machu Picchu and experience the amazing beauty of this world wonder when Peru was just allowing tourists back in and it was definitely an unforgettable experience. All right, so just got off the Machu Picchu train, an hour and a half carving through the canyons alongside the Incan Trail. We are here in Machu Picchu village known as Aguas Calientes, which is where you get the bus early in the morning to head up to Machu Picchu. So we got up at 5 a.m. this morning, got our bus ticket, and then we're on the second bus up right around 6.15 we left so we are just a few minutes up the trail here and you have your necessary llama sighting he's about what two feet behind me <laughs> right here he's not scared at all oh it's just beautiful i mean how cool is this how often do you get to see llamas doing their daily morning run this guy behind us is just chilling out kind of supervising while his maybe five cousins or something behind us here are kind of sprinting back and forth so this is absolutely amazing here i mean you will never see Machu Picchu this abandoned. I know it's hard to get here, hard to get into Peru, the double masks, all the effort. I mean, to get this place basically to yourself, one of the most famous tourist destinations in the world, probably the most famous place in South America, and to have what looks like about 10 or 20 people here ahead of us. I mean, this is just absolutely insane. It makes all the effort to get here definitely worth it. So we've been here for almost an hour at the lookout. There are a few more people coming for sure. But I heard one of the guides saying, I mean, you will never see this few people here in your lifetime. It seemed like the llamas have come up and uh, kind of become more and more friendly here. And uh, this one is posing behind us here for photos. Clearly he's a fan favorite. So we are down here walking among all the different structures. We've come down from the viewpoint way up above there and uh, definitely filling up with some more people, but still fairly quiet compared to normal time. And it's fun to get different perspectives after being up top to being down here kind of inside the different structures and that you can appreciate all the architecture here, all the rocks and stones around us. All right, time to get back on the train here after visiting Machu Picchu, one of the wonders of the world. If you like my travel and outdoors videos, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. And thank you for your support as I visit every country in the world.